place you got here. It's a pleasure to have you here in my house. Why don't you get comfortable and then we can make sweet, sweet intercourse. Okay. Oh no. It's Frank. You need to hide. Um, just hide in the cupboard. Oh, yeah, okay. Why didn't you open the fucking door? Hello, baby. It's daddy! You fucking call me daddy, shithead! Where's my fucking bourbon? Here you go. Where's my fucking Cocoa Pops? Yeah, sorry, I, I forgot about your Cocoa Pops. I don't fucking wanna. Don't you fucking look at me. Show it to me. Show me your mutt. Show me your clunge. Show me your gash. Show me your fucking Volvo. Va, Volva. Mommy, baby wants to fuck. Don't you fucking look at me. All right, sorry. I'm gonna fucking fuck you, you fucking fuck. Fuck. Baby wants blue velvet. I don't actually have any blue velvet, but I have some yellow velvet. She wore yellow velvet. It's the only velvet I own. It's the only velvet that I own. What do you mean you only got fucking yellow velvet? Just give me some fucking velvet. Yep, there you go. Was that fucking noise? Now don't you fucking look at me, you fucking, you fuck, you fuck. Frank, there's, there's no one in the cupboard. If there's someone in there, then I'm gonna fucking fuck them up.
Ah! And that was my bedroom remake of the feature film Blue Velvet. I think this is probably my most niche and polarizing remake so far, but surprisingly also the most requested. Sure, it was only requested by one person, but multiple times. And if you haven't seen the film, then I implore you to go and watch it. And that brings us to today's moral. We live in a world where Disney reigns supreme, and most of the content we're ingesting is either going through a cookie cutter, or it's a remake or a reboot, capturing that nostalgia high. So I want you, this week, to go and watch something you wouldn't usually watch, like a David Lynch film perhaps. But, in saying that, in a couple of weeks I will be releasing a remake of The Avengers. Have a good day. Mom, let me...